In the ever-evolving world of electric vehicles, Tesla is once again making headlines. This time, it's not about a new car model or a groundbreaking technology, but rather a strategic move that could reshape the battery industry and potentially boost Tesla's stock value. Curious? Let's dive in. Tesla, the electric vehicle giant, is setting its sights on Indonesia, with plans for a quite big investment to establish a battery factory in the country. This revelation comes from none other than Indonesia's senior minister, Luhut Panjaitan, who recently shared about his meeting with Tesla CEO, Elon Musk, on Instagram. This isn't the first time Tesla has shown interest in Indonesia. Back in April 2022, Tesla officials met with their Indonesian counterparts to discuss a potential deal concerning nickel, a crucial material used in electric vehicle batteries. This meeting saw the participation of key figures, including the Indonesian ambassador to the United States, Rosengro Aslani, and Anindya Bakrai, the general chair of the Advisory Council of the Chamber of Commerce and Industry. Fast forward to the present, and another significant meeting has taken place, this time in San Francisco. Here, Panjaitan and Musk spent over two hours discussing Indonesia's economic development and the current state of Tesla incorporated interestingly, while a vehicle production facility in Indonesia seems off the table, a battery materials plant is very much in the cards. However, there's a twist. Some statements from Panjaitan hint at Tesla possibly suspending its investment. This suspension, as reported by Reuters, is attributed to two primary reasons, overproduction and the current unfavorable global economic conditions. Yet, the intent to invest in lithium battery material manufacturing remains evident, with the minister emphasizing that the investment would be quite big. Establishing a battery factory in Indonesia is a strategic move for Tesla. Indonesia is rich in nickel, a vital component for EV batteries. By investing in a battery materials plant in the country, Tesla can secure a steady supply of this essential material, reducing dependency on external suppliers and potentially lowering production costs. This move signifies Tesla's commitment to expanding its global footprint and tapping into emerging markets. Indonesia, with its vast population and growing middle class, presents a lucrative market for electric vehicles. By establishing a presence in the country, Tesla not only secures its supply chain but also positions itself to capture a significant share of the Indonesian EV market in the future. However, the news also comes with its set of challenges. The mention of Tesla suspending its investment due to overproduction and global economic conditions raises concerns. Overproduction could lead to an oversupply, potentially driving down prices and affecting profitability. The global economic landscape, still reeling from the effects of the pandemic and geopolitical tensions, adds another layer of uncertainty. Yet, despite these challenges, the long-term prospects look promising. The global shift towards sustainable energy and transportation is undeniable. As countries ramp up their efforts to combat climate change, the demand for electric vehicles and renewable energy solutions will only grow. Tesla, with its pioneering technology and brand reputation, is well poised to capitalize on this trend. Moreover, there's also mention of bringing Starlink, Tesla's satellite internet service, to eastern Indonesia. This move can have profound implications, from improving healthcare infrastructure in remote areas to enhancing educational access. Such initiatives not only bolster Tesla's image as a company committed to social impact but also open up new revenue streams. In conclusion, while there are short-term challenges to navigate, the potential benefits of Tesla's investment in Indonesia are immense. If executed well, this move can strengthen Tesla's supply chain, expand its market reach, and further solidify its position as a leader in the EV industry. Now, let's talk about the upcoming trading session on August 15, 2023. We've got some surge signals to watch out for. On the upside, we have $242.36, $244.97, and $249.27. On the downside, the numbers to watch are $235.45, $231.15, and $228.54. These signals indicate potential price points that could confirm a directional move for the stock. If the stock approaches or breaches these levels, it could signify a strong move in that direction. 
For instance, if the stock surpasses $249.27, it might indicate a bullish trend, while dropping below $228.54 could suggest a bearish move. That wraps up our deep dive into Tesla's potential investment in Indonesia and its implications for the stock. If you found this analysis insightful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more updates. And here's a question for you, do you think Tesla's move into Indonesia will be a game changer for the EV industry? Share your thoughts in the comments below.